Hello everybody and welcome back to Tony Z TV. Welcome back to another paranormal reaction video. Today we're going to do another of the Nukes Top 5 scary reaction videos. I went back to videos from last year, so this one's from like June of 2020. Of uh, 5 scary ghost videos to trigger your anxiety. It's about 14 minutes and 5 seconds long. My lights are not completely off like the last video. I noticed in the last video when I did that, as fun as it was. Uh, the video had a tendency to make it so dark that you couldn't even see my face. So I've got my my uh, ring light back on so we can at least see my reaction in this video. But I have it dimmed down a little bit so it's not as bright. But yeah, that's what we're going to do for this video. Hopefully you all enjoy it. If you do, as always, please be sure to let me know by hitting the like button, leaving a comment below, sharing the, the channel so that we can continue to grow the channel. And of course, subscribing to the channel and hitting the little notification bell. Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the five scary ghost videos to trigger your anxiety. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got for this video. Top five ghosts caught on camera. Scary things in creepy basements. Oh my gosh, I hate creepy YouTube basements. user Advil claims that while he was upstairs, he could hear strange noises and even voices coming from his basement. Always the freaking basement, goes to check man. it out, and it did not go well. Hello. Oh, uh, this We're looks a lot like light. very similar All to right. my basement, which is even creepier. Only his basement's actually finished, and mine's not. Man. Hello. What's in his basement? Is that where his computer setup is? Hello. I almost thought that was a person over there. No. Okay. I thought he saw I something. I heard something. Man. Nothing. Is anyone there? Uh, what is this? It must be a window or something that they got covered up. Random picture of a tiger. Whoa! Woo! A large display case seems to move on Hold its up. own. I thought I saw something, not just the display case moving. Whoa, what is this? Is this something? Okay, I think it's just a. I thought there was something standing there for a minute there. A large that display looks like case something seems standing to move there. on its own, and Advil just gets out of there. But two nights later, again, oh, no. hears the strange voices. Coming from the basement. There's something down there, dude. You saw I heard something some move. Again. Hello? Oh no. The frick? <laughs> Did you see it? When yeah, I down, freaking you saw that. Walking across the doorway at the bottom of the stairs. Yo, what are you? YouTuber nah, says screw that, that. At the time of this recording, he was renting the house. He He's recently renting moved the house? to a new home <laughs> and says that he has not had any more paranormal experiences. That's a full-fledged person YouTuber, walking across Patrick the floor, Yonson man. claims that when Yikes. he went down to his apartment's poorly lit basement, he decided to test his new video camera in the dark surroundings. And that's when he saw something truly disturbing. Oh, great. These basement ones, man. Our freaking washing machine is in the basement, and I hate going down there at nighttime. I only do the laundry during the day. Forget it. It's so creepy down there. What is happening? Is this a basement or an apartment complex? Um. I saw that. There's nobody behind him. There's a full-fledged dang shadow walking right here. Yeah, look at you, just walking left to right. Don't mind me, I'm just walking across the hall doing my daily business. Whatever I gotta do down here. This is a basement? Now, yeah, big I think basement. it's safe to say that the camera works pretty well in the dark, but yeah, what do you think? There's lights on right there. That is a weird Schools one. Schools out. 
Korean ghost hunter Tosa Ochi explores everything from creepy temples to haunted buildings and abandoned mental hospitals. He broadcasts his investigations live on the website africatv.com. Tosa Ochi also uploads the creepiest highlights from his live stream to his YouTube channel. In this video sent in by one of his fans, the ghost hunter investigates an allegedly haunted elementary school in Chalado, South Korea. The school has been abandoned for nearly 20 years. Schools are As creepy Tosa too, Ochi man. mixes his way through the building's creepy hallways, and hospitals. he begins to hear strange unexplained sounds. Always with the schools in a- That stall just opened? Oh. The frick was that? What the hell? Wow, wait a minute, I really- Wait a minute. There's no detention in the afterlife, you're free to go home. Class isn't in session anymore. He hears the loud bang of what sounds like that a slamming loud. door, and runs for his life from the creepy school building. He doesn't want to go back inside, but after repeated requests by his livestream viewers, he gathers his courage and heads back inside. <laughs> Gave into that, uh, that peer pressure, man. Perhaps you shouldn't have. Oh. What's that light down there? Maybe that's just his flashlight. <laughs> Bro, I don't think you want to know where that sound's coming from. You should have stayed outside. You probably could have looked up in the window and seen stuff. I thought I was going to see something in that window. I didn't see anything. Wait. Dude, this sounds right next to him. Did he see Tosa something? Ochi hears the chilling sound of a school desk moving across the floor somewhere in the building. Maybe then it's residual? the unexplained sound of something falling nearby sends him running for safety once again. But now, Tosa Ochi decides to go back inside and try to provoke the spirit to show itself. Oh no, why would you do that, man? Not smart. Now you're trying to provoke it. Now you're really gonna get messed with. I didn't even see it. What I miss? I just saw him scream and then run. Oh my god, a freaking giraffe, man! I thought that thing was real for a minute there. Out, he decides to set up his camera to record the dark school hallway as he gathers his nerve outside. That's what he should have done. he catches on camera is truly chilling. Oh, great. Oh, great. Oh! Hold up! That's more than a shadow figure, man. That's a full freaking, like, woman face peering out of there. Look at you! You're just watching the camera, watching you. You know it's there and you don't like it, but you're just peeking around that corner. Man, this ain't hide and seek. Go away! Is it moving? Now it's coming out from back there! It's coming from two to- Whoa! Look, I just moved even faster! The thing keeps poking its head out, man! Bro, you don't see that?! It's just looking right at you, man! That freaking thing peeked out like four different times. Not one, but two mysterious figures seem to peek out into yeah, the Yeah, that hallway. one was completely separate. Tosa Ochi heads inside once more. That one looks like the size of a teacher. The spirits that haunt the school. Dumb. It did not go well. Dumb. So good, Kosa. Kosa. Yeah, I didn't like that. It's about to start running at you, man. My biggest fear: oh, footsteps running towards you. Dude, it already came out. It looked right at your dang camera, son. Oh, it's already done that. You're just cussing at the spirit. He definitely don't realize there's more than one. Um... Yeah, I saw you. Right there, man. 
walking from like le right to left. Right around that corner. Oh, that looked like a full on oh, person. Did you see it? Oh yeah, I Someone freaking saw it. Something seems to be silently walking along the second floor. Screw that. Hey man, you talked to show itself. That's on what? you. That's on you, man. You're in there provoking stuff. <laughs> That's like three different oh, spirits now. Oh my god. He definitely to see gone more now. Plus Ochi's investigations, you can head over to his YouTube channel or you can watch his almost daily live streams on africatv.com. Come hell or high water. Oh man, that doesn't sound popular good. Popular YouTuber TechRax has been testing the durability of technology for years, especially the Samsung Galaxy series and the Apple iPhone. Agreed. On his channel, you can watch these phones get destroyed in pretty much every way imaginable. He drops them from extreme heights, crushes them with cars, shocks them with tasers, pounds them with hammers, there's hot knives, gas torches, and even a lawnmower. How much you money does this guy have dude, running over phones and destroying phones edit. like that? However, when testing the durability of his brand new iPhone 11 Pro, things take an unexpected turn. He travels seven hours to an isolated spot in the Nevada desert. He plans to drop the iPhone 11 into a 50 foot deep hot spring named Diana's Whoa. Punch Bowl. For unknown That's reasons, this hot spring is also known by the name the Devil's Cauldron. Gee, I wonder why. To the location, guys. I Probably because she's in be dropping phones in it. Super windy. We're basically in the middle of this desert. Uh, I want to show you guys the rig of what exactly is going to go on first before I even show you the hole. Now I want to show you guys the actual hole. So it's crazy, man. It's like close, a giant crater. Just a couple steps here. That's Pretty so crazy, bizarre. guys. You can see there's steam coming straight out of this water. It's supposed to be about 140 to 180 degrees Fahrenheit, so you will burn yourself if you tried, uh, like, taking a dip in here. But it's super safe. How would you take a Literally dip? In the middle You'd have of to nowhere. drop a rope down. Now, there. the first time Tech Rex drops his recording iPhone into the extremely hot water, the phone comes out fine, and the footage shows nothing particularly strange. That's odd. It came out fine in 140 degree water? Like it didn't melt? Crazy. But the second time he drops his phone into the Devil's Cauldron, things get a little weird. In and of itself, he reviews the footage later. He's shocked by what he finds. Whoa. Sounds like someone's screaming. What is that, man? What is that screaming? What the frick? It sounds like screaming. Rick says he has no idea what could have caused this strange underwater screaming, especially since his first recording didn't pick up any odd sounds. What is that, at man? All. The freaking portal to hell? So, Maybe that's why it's called the Devil's think this Cauldron. Strange sound from the Devil's Cauldron could be. That was weird because that was know water. Down in the comments. You can watch this full video as well as TechRack's examination of the footage over on his YouTube channel. Hider in the hallway. Agree. This next video was shared to Facebook by Jennifer Majors, who works as the manager of the Haunted Eagles Nest Hotel in Quincy, Illinois. Because this, this girl knew what she was getting herself at the hotel by claimed there. to have seen unexplained shadows in the hotel's halls and heard bizarre childlike giggling when no one else was around. Screw that. When supplies began to mysteriously disappear from the housekeeper's cleaning carts, Jennifer checked the CCTV footage for an explanation. But instead, she found something downright terrifying. What is that? Is that something back there? Maybe I'm looking in the wrong spot. In the empty hallway, a childlike shadow you just figure run came out quickly running from some... the elevator that thing is towards the car, and then mysteriously darting back out of sight. Don't you need cleaning supplies now, this for? Could just you trying to explain toilets? away as a CCTV compression error? Maybe but that doesn't explain the speed of the movement. Also, Super it should fast. be noted that there is no light seen coming from inside the elevator. That looks like a straight up kid. So the elevator doors that this figure seems to run out of are closed. Are closed. Even so is this the ghost of a child running around the Eagle's Nest Hotel, or is it all just an elaborate hoax? 
You, you never decide. really know, do you? Down Very below. bizarre, though. Reddit users Spiders Are Disgusting says that this <laughs> next video was spiders filmed a few disgusting. years back while they were outside doing stunts on their trampoline. Later, when they watched their video back, this. So this person wasn't trying to catch anything, they are just doing stunts. Um, yeah, I see you. Did you see it? Yeah, it looks like the freaking girl from the ring just crawled out of the freaking well and is walking by the trampoline, man. What the heck is going on? Watch again. Straight up, just walking away in a white dress and long what black looks hair. looks like a little girl with long dark hair wearing a white dress crawls out from under the trampoline at a very unnatural angle. I mean, it looks like the girl what from makes the dang it ring. even creepier is that some Reddit viewers note that the girl's neck looks like it's bent sideways. Oh, that's even creepier. Reddit user Spiders Are Disgusting says that to I didn't this notice day, that. they have no idea who this mysterious disappearing girl is. That's creepy. But you better do some research on that what property. Do you think? I think you need to do some Thanks research watching, on that property. If you see a video that you think should be in the top five, be sure to email us at nukestop5 at gmail.com and follow me on Twitter at nukestop5. See you next week. All right, there you have it for another paranormal reaction video. That last one was pretty creepy, that thing walking out from under the trampoline like that. That was bizarre. A lot of the stuff is bizarre. The really freaky one in the school with the stuff looking out at the dude. And there was like three, four different spirits there. There's definitely something going on there. Yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to hit the like button for your boy. Drop a comment below on your favorite part. Or if you know of any other scary or paranormal videos out there on YouTube or other channels maybe that I haven't checked out yet, uh, let me know and I will check them out in the future. But yeah, as always, thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in the next video. But until then, happy haunting, everybody. Bye-bye.